when police detective Steve Fulcher obtained a confession from a cold-hearted murderer, he should have been celebrated. Instead, it derailed his police career because a judge ruled the killer's rights had been breached because correct procedure hadn't been followed. Uh, what happened to Steve Fulcher, whose detective work led to the conviction of double murderer Christopher Halliwell, is now the subject of an ITV drama called A Confession. Well, we're joined by Sean O'Callaghan's brother, Liam, and the screenwriter, Jeff Pope. Morning Good to both morning. of you. Thanks very much for coming in. I mean, we've seen the first episode already, yeah. which is just gripping stuff. I mean, Liam, for you, when you were first approached by Jeff, obviously this is such an intensely personal story for your family, such an awful thing for you to have had to go through. What did you, what did you feel? Were you sort of wholeheartedly on board? Did you want this story to be told? Um, yeah, of course, uh, sort of surprised um, about being approached about this drama coming out. Um, and nervous, uh, concerned. But um, I'd seen Jeff's uh, body of work before. Um, I knew that we were kind of in safe hands. He was going to produce a very accurate piece of work. Um, and as, as a family, we came to sort of a collective decision mm. that we felt that there was a need for the complete story to be told. Um, and uh, specifically to uh, showcase um, sort of Fulcher's actions, um, the reasons why he took those actions, um, uh, and uh, and yeah. Um. What you have, I think, in this, uh, which in the first episode, um, Jeff, is this is about the families hearing that these these two people have gone missing, and Sean's mm. family hearing about it, and. And then you've got the, 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 a lot of detail of the police procedure of how these investigations ramp up. And why it's so interesting to watch is, you, from, a, just from a human perspective, you really feel this, just this impending sense of, of doom as, as you're watching the show. Yeah, it's, it, it's, um, it's a six-parter. <clears throat> and it's kind of a story told in two halves. There's, there's a thriller, which is a girl's gone missing. There's a huge hunt for her. The second half really is about... It opens out into what happens, the experience of the families and what happens to Fulcher. There's a procedure, there's a way that police have to act. I wonder, though, when that uh, legislation was brought in, if they, if they envisage 35 years later, really, the, the overwhelming majority of suspects now just say no comment. Mm. Yeah. That's what yeah. Fulcher was trying to get through when he said, I don't, I don't want to read the rights to this guy. I don't want to say you have the right to remain silent because I want you to tell me where Sean is. Fulcher operates in this kind of grey area, this yes. moral grey area. Yeah. He was condemned by the police for doing it, but for you, lost it's... His career, lost his career. Lost his career. I know, Liam, the family is supportive of him because it's not... I guess from the police rules, it's black and white, but it isn't black and white from a, a human perspective, right? That's right. It, it, the, the, the question right at the core of everything is what would you want him to have done if it was your, mm. your if you were Liam. one missing. Mm. If you were Liam. You, as a family, backed his decision? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Wholeheartedly. Uh, um, it's just um, unfortunate that, you know, in, in the court of law, you know, it was deemed that uh, he acted uh, inappropriately. Liam, tell us, tell us about too. Sean. Um, yeah, she's... Uh, uh, she was an amazing individual, uh, very positive. And that is at the heart of this. This is a very... Uh, this is a drama about some very real human tragedy. Yeah. Um, and, and I think that's always clear throughout it. it. It never feels fictional at any point. And Martin Freeman does, I think, a fantastic job as mm. Fulcher as well. Um, Liam, thank you for coming in and thank you for talking to us. Right. Jeff Pope, um, you are an outstanding writer. We're familiar with your body of work, including Philomena, and I think this is, um, you know, the equal of everything else that you've done. So congratulations thank on you. that. On another fantastic piece of work. Is it, is it Monday? Is it, when's it on Monday. TV? Monday, what, yeah. what time? It's nine o'clock, Monday. For six Mondays. OK, nine o'clock Monday, ITV, A Confession. A confession Do watch it. this Monday. Uh, Jeff, Liam, thank you very much. Thank, thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you.